is you just type in uh, Steam command. Uh, you just go in Google, type in Steam command, and it should pop you up to this page. Depending on the OS, uh, you want to download it, like Windows. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna. Uh, yeah, you want to actually install it. Desktop, save. It's gonna be in a compressed zip folder. All I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna cut it. I think I may already have a folder in a by Steam for Steam command. But anywho, you go into here. Um, hmm. Steam command. I'm gonna delete this because it's already full. Yeah. Paste. You want to paste that in there? Uh, I just recommend um, putting it with your Steam. Open this up. You open it up, and you press run because it says Publisher Valve application. This you do not need a an it admin was a password. It a beautiful day in the Badlands. The sniper was filling his Girati. He had a special plan for the engineer. He was going to be a urinal today. Well, that's holding up. You want to go into Google and type in uh, TF2 Steam Command Dedicated Server Commands. So you actually want to go over here and you want to look at this stuff that, that my mouse is circling. Okay. So what I want to do is you want to press Login Anonymous. Because if you log into your Steam account, then it usually crashes trying to download it because it says that you're already online because you have to be... Steam has to be open if you do this. But if you log in with Steam already, like I'm logging with my profile, if you're logging in with that, then it actually crashes this and along with Steam and says, please try again later. So that's why I wanted to use Anonymous. Once that's logged in, license info. Okay. Now, before we install anything, you want to make a new folder. Call it I'm going to call it TF2 LAN server. I'm gonna rename it. Uh, just rename. Make it local air network server. Okay. You want the copy address? Okay. Minimize this now. Now you want to do is force install dr. If you press Control V for paste, it just gives you the alternate V. So what you actually have to do, you have to press this little thing that the mouse is on. When my cursor's on. You want to edit, paste. Okay, it's already installing. Okay, you want to do app underscore update two three two two five zero. Once you have the update, you press enter. It's gonna take a while. Mine, I don't have the fastest internet, but <clears throat> see, it's point two three percent done. When it's at a hundred, when it, when this is at like a hundred point oh oh, that means it's done downloading. Once that's installed, you press quit. Okay, and then you go into the Steam folder where you actually had it in. Network, if you're going to make a network, you need to port forward your thing, which I'm not going to go over because I don't really want to port forward. So, or come password, I'm just going to make it 1234 because it's a LAN server. So, server name. Mr. Creeper Dash. Start server. Okay. Arena, I don't like Arena, my opinion. Should I do that payload race, uh, high tower event? There. Should be good. Um, <clears throat> and. Mm hmm. So, let's just start TF2 now. Let's go to servers, LAN, and it's the same name. Uh, if you can see, because the name is Mr. Creeper Dash. You enter. I'm gonna go blue because I like blue. And there we go. We have it. It's gonna take 22 seconds just to wait for our players. But I don't really care. Um, 
and just waits for other players before it actually starts, like maybe your friends or anybody like if you're a live plug library. And yeah, so. So, I hope you guys really enjoyed this. I thought this was really, uh, this would be really helpful. I wish I had, uh, my friend, but obviously I'm, I feel like crap. I don't really feel like talking. I don't think I'm talking right now. So, <clears throat> hope this was, uh, really helpful, guys. See ya. Oh, my God.